Warren Buffett, Bill Ackman, Ray Dalio. You are wondering how they are making money from stock market. So in this video, we will see what they are buying or what they are selling at the moment. You don't need to reinvent everything. They have hundreds of people that analyzing stock market every second. So in this video, I will show you how you can see hedge funds portfolio for free. You don't need to pay anything. You don't need to give any percentage. So they are all free and it is waiting for you to explore. So bear with me until end of the video so you don't miss any tip and suggestions. Before we start, please hit the subscribe and like button. And before we lose any time, let's jump in the video. I have three different resources that you can check all these activities for free. So I will show you all of them. You are free to choose which one is most suitable for you. And for the demonstration purposes, I will go with Peloton stock so that you will see how the insider or hedge funds or institutions buy or sell uh, affect the price directly. So let's start with the first one and the first one is hedgefollow.com. So you come in their homepage, it's very easy and there are no ads which is very nice for this type of free resource and you can see that featured hedge funds Warren Buffett, Carl, George Soros, David Einhorn, blah, blah, blah. It goes like that. You can go by person or hedge fund or you can go with just stock. So let's take a look at the first Bill Ackman, what he bought or sold. If you would like to do that, you come here and you can clearly see that 25% of the Bill Ackman portfolio is LOV. And the next one is Hilton. The other one is uh, CMG, the other, the most of the restaurants. So if you would like to just check out the stock, let's say Peloton, right? You come here and you will see top shareholders. So the biggest one is Valiant Capital Management. And the second one is Alden Global Capital. And you can see their value of their holdings of shares, they have nearly 1 million shares, it's a huge amount and 5% of their portfolio, they are keep buying and they just increase their position by 82.38%. Maybe they know something that we don't know and this is the point that why we are following hedge funds activities every time. So because they are smart people and in the end of the year, the most probably they are making money and that's why it is very important so the other features that we can see the largest trades that happened in peloton so in q4 2021 we are seeing the buys and the elden global capital is added the peloton their portfolio in this quarter so we can see the ownership history here and this is the nice chart of Peloton. It's just going down and down. And how many percentage of the portfolio and the hedge fund rank. And this is uh, the algorithm from the hedge follow. So it's not a global rank or something. So they are their personal uh, ratings. So the sales, you can see also who sold the Peloton uh, AMC uh ultimate capital crosslink they are all exited from peloton and it's a huge amount you can see uh they have sold nearly 687 80 no 28000 shares in just one uh, quarter so we can see that they entered the peloton they increased the position in the next quarter and now they exited so most probably in a huge loss and the money flow section uh, very easy 
money flow from other stocks into Peloton. So they sold CRM, they sold Microsoft, they sold Adobe and they bought Peloton. So this is a very nice chart and the most uh, the pie came from Salesforce, which is CRM, right? And Microsoft, very interesting. And who sold Peloton is both Amazon, Uber, Microsoft, Nvidia, Google, and Tesla. And funds that invest Peloton also invest Amazon, uh, Rivian, Netflix, Facebook, Uber, and it goes like this, frequently bought with Peloton, frequently sold with Peloton. And you can all see this for free, which is amazing. So these are the trends, how funds adjusted their positions in Peloton over time. And uh, unfortunately, we are seeing that they are all closing out or selling their positions. And the last quarter was a disaster for Peloton. And total value of buy and sales of Peloton over time, again, uh, sell amount is 1.1 billion dollar and buy amount is 830 million dollar what we can expect is hedge funds and institutions losing their hope for peloton right a very clear picture no need to discuss uh, I wish good luck for peloton so uh, this is hedgefollow.com very nice and so easy to use so understandable and as i said before you can go by person or you can go by uh, stock so if you go into warren buffett stock portfolio you can see their performance and you can see their uh, hold, uh, total amount of their stocks how many holdings and all their holdings is here the biggest one is apple nearly 50 percent and the second one is bank of america and third one is american express and it goes like that so if they increased or changed their position sizes you can see here for free and there is one thing that important all those hedge funds are reporting their positions in the end of the every quarter so we can only see these numbers uh, when they report sometimes they report uh, their trades and we see uh, those numbers before the date come but in the most scenario most cases we will see when the quarter ends so largest trades in q4 for warren buffett is he bought five billion dollar value of occidental peat corporation i don't know what is it maybe it's the first time i saw he bought activision uh, genius guy because microsoft is buying activision and uh, the portfolio structure we can see technology finance uh, non durables blah 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 and sector allocation if he change it how it changed this is crazy and these are all free you can come and do your own research maybe those kind of information is not so much suitable for day trading but if you are going to uh, make your long-term portfolio this is a treasure for you come and please check out come and see what big guys are buying at the moment so performance history of Warren Buffett you can see here and I believe this is a benchmark yes this is S&P 500 this is Berkshire and surprisingly S&P is beating the Warren Buffett so let's check out the next resource which is veilwisdom.com again nice website my second favorite one but the problem here is they have so much ads and so much pop-ups that it's so uh you know irritating so let's what it said it's um, it's you can also search funds and you can also search stocks so let's go with peloton because of the demonstration purposes we see who is peloton here 
We see market cap, PA ratios. It's not available, I believe. Shares outstanding. Uh, a classical information. I don't know if we need to see it or not, but they put it, so no problem. Uh, CEO is John Foley. It has changed. So let's see. Why I like this? Because they have this table. It's so informative and they put it everything in a brie briefly. So let's start. In top 10, uh, how many funds holding? So we have uh, 561 hedge funds holding currently at the moment. But uh, previously it was 623 hedge funds. So we have a drop of 10%. And uh, this is very important. And what I mean by prior is uh, Q3. We are now seeing Q4, right? So in top 10 means that in their uh, top 10 biggest holdings, that means. So again, huge drop, 32%. And 13 F shares means that how many shares hedge funds are holding it has increased they said ownership uh, it has increased which is nice and new positions we are seeing new positions and new hedge funds are joining uh, opening new positions in Peloton increased positions who has positions at the moment increase their position and also closed positions has increased, reduced positions has decreased. So because I think that everyone is stuck. And total calls, total puts, this is very nice. This is very nice. You can see that also. So the next thing what we are going to look at is you can see a detailed listing here. So we can sort by uh, how many percentage of their portfolio. So we are seeing that 48% sorry 10% of the portfolio 8% of the portfolio blah 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 it goes like this and when they bought an estimated average price paid is very important column here also and the quarter that first owned and when they reported so you can see all those for free again and come and check it by yourself so uh, I'm not so much into those details. So you can come and new, closed out, edit, reduce, no change. You can see the, those things. And now let's look at if we can see Berkshire, Hateway, 13 F filers. Let's see new purchases, three stocks, additional purchase, four stocks, sold out of two stocks, reduced holdings, eight stocks. Blah, blah, blah. It goes like that. So again, very similar to hedgefollow.com. And I think that ah, now this is subscription required. Not necessary. You don't need to subscribe because those things are free in hedgefollow.com. And there is a detailed chart. But what I think is if you would like to go buy uh, hedge funds in detail, you can go and check it out in hedge follow.com because it has more you know uh, more briefly and easily you can understand so but you can come and many you can see managers global holdings but it's again subscribe subscription required but you can see holdings so that is all for the whalewisdom.com let's continue with the next one which is data roma and this is famous because you can see uh, it's like it's giving you like top 10 most owned stocks, top 10 stocks by percentage. They are nice data, top, top big bets. So it's very interesting. Micron technology is max percentage of portfolio is 78%. It is really big bet and nine First nine people has this Micron technology again Apple and we know that Warren Buffett and you can see uh, super investors portfolio updates here maybe you know some of those names 
I will not go so much in detail, but I am seeing Bill Ackman here. So let's see. He is now famous with his Netflix position. He has lost nearly half a billion dollar just like that. So uh, he has very low number of stocks. He kept is seven and they are all like consumer stocks, Domino's, Lowe, Hilton, blah, blah, blah. He reduced his position. It is nice. It's clear, but there are a lot of lot of ads and I hate it. And you can also go by again stock name. Let's see Peloton ownership count three ownership rank 187. So I think those numbers are not so much correct. Portfolio manager ownership. Uh, so let's see. Okay. Ah. Josh Chase, Viking Global Investor. So this is not so much correct data, but what you can see is you can more see like investors profile by his name or her name. So they are not so much into stocks, but they are famous with their uh, portfolio managers. So this portfolio manager has bought CRM. Spotify, Amazon, Netflix, it goes like this. So you can see the most famous investors portfolio in this website. But as we can see that we know that a lot of hedge funds and a lot of investor has Peloton in their portfolio, but they are not covering all investors here. So it's an interesting alternative, but uh, this is my less, less favorite uh resource but again this is free you can come and check it out so that was all for this video i hope you like it i hope you found it useful and i hope you will make money with using this free data and before you leave please consider subscribing to my channel and like this video because it helps a lot and we are uh, giving those informations free to everyone and it will spread all over the world if you hit the like button uh, thank you for watching i hope you see you soon take care and bye for now